Today is a sad day on the J and A channel. It's so cute. You gotta stop. Thank you for changing my life. Good morning. Welcome to the vlog. AJ has her first big, huge shift today. She's working from 9 a.m. to 6 on a Saturday. So she's so excited. She's nervous, but she's, she's excited. You know our girl loves to work, so. We are gonna make her some lunch. She's still getting ready. We're gonna make her some lunch so that she has plenty of fuel to get over this day. This freaking turkey, y'all, three ingredients. Three ingredients. Organic turkey, water, salt, period. bag and we're looking like we got a lot of crumbs. Where's your bag? Okay, if we can keep it like this. <laughs> I thought you were, Weasley, why do you look like you are just contemplating everything you've ever been through? He does this every morning. Are we stressed today? Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. He loves you guys. <laughs> what? It wasn't recording, was it? It is now. <laughs> I'm so glad that wasn't on camera because I was heartbroken. I couldn't listen to it again. What is it with me and my fingers? You hate your fingers. Oh my God. Look, it's already like dented. I'm just feeling better at this one. I just was trying to move the tripod and the tripod ate like Pac-Man my freaking finger <laughs> and I couldn't get it. It was not at a position where I could get it and I had to make Annika come over here and get it. Oh my God, it, it burns. I'm in pain. Oh dear Lord. Oh. You're wearing your new jeans. I'm wearing my new jeans. How do they feel? I love them. And I went on a hunt for a pe black pair, and she she TikTok vlogged it, but she found these at freaking Target. These Levi's, how cute. They only had them in a size 27. Yeah. Which I'm a 28. There's a tag that's. But that felt weird. Do you want like us poking you? All right, let's get an OOTD. My shirt is Glamour Formals. My jeans are Levi's from Target. So cute. so cute. And my Converse from DSW. I Cutie. love them. They're my go-to for everything. And my little work bag, it can fit everything I need to in there. I don't want to need. Except for your lunchbox today. Except for my lunchbox today. But if I wanted to, it really could. There we go. You got your muffin. I don't have a How many today hours is it today? Why don't I just show you guys? It's eight hours and 15 minutes. Eight hours and 15 minutes, okay. Which will probably, well, I'm going in no, early. No, that's when you were supposed to go in at 9.45. Yeah, so, so you're going in 45 minutes yeah. Plus 45 is nine. Crazy. So. Well, have fun. Yeah. I think I'm going to do a in a hot style, time stamped hour check-in TikTok for my first nine hour sh shift. Okay. I think that's going to be my. Well, don't put too much pressure on yourself. Oh. It might, maybe I'm wait and see how crazy it's going to be. Well, yeah. Before, because it's homecoming season and people are homecoming in. If I can't, I can't. Yeah. But it was just in the back of my mind. Thanks for happy tears. I just watched um, Gretchen and Remy's engagement vlogs back to back. That was just such a mistake. I mean, that was just such a mistake. That was such a mistake. Because... I love those girls both so much and like they are both in just such wonderful like healthy relationships and when you see your friends and like people that you love in good healthy relationships and just love and it's just such a fun age of like getting to see people start their lives and I would definitely recommend watching both vlogs but maybe take a lunch break in between maybe watch one on Monday and one on Wednesday um because it was just I mean it's just so precious like Cal and Max, both. They're just great. They're, they're great and like, I, 
it's it's crazy to me that I've gone from like being fans of both of those girls to actually like knowing them now and knowing so many of their friends too and every single person I've ever met like says the same thing like that they're just they're just such they're such great couples they're such great couples so congrats to Gretchen and Remy oh the YouTube world's about to have so much bridal content oh my god wow so fun so fun but I fully have been sobbing for like a full hour at this point <laughs> Truly. Hi, Marcy. Would you say hi to the vlog? Would you say hi to the vlog? She said, please, for the love of God, put me down. Hi. I wish I was wearing a different color shirt just to show y'all, like, how big this cat is. <laughs> She's my dream cat. I don't, have I ever told y'all this? I had this picture pinned on my Pinterest board since, like, 2015. I'm not kidding. Like, I saw this picture, and I was like, I want a cat that looks just like that one day. That's not Myrtle. That's not Myrtle. This was a picture that I pinned off freaking Pinterest. And like, it's also the picture, I have it screenshotted the day that, um, from my Pinterest, the day that we took her to the vet for the first time after we found her. If you weren't around from when we found Myrtle, we actually found her the night my very best friend got engaged. Got home super late. Anna had fallen asleep on the car ride home. Like we were exhausted. We'd been up and going all day and I'd been like stressing out, and, like running around in the background, getting things done. And we got home and we heard this like screeching meow coming from a tire and it was Myrtle. And we like both got on our hands and knees like with flashlights. It was like almost midnight. We're like looking around for this cat. She's stuck in a tire of one of our neighbor's tires. And like we could, I mean, if, if that car would have like started up and gone, she would have been so we pull her out, her paws like stuck. We finally pull her out. We get her inside. She's covered in fleas. She's matted. She looks like this. Okay, we put her in a box and she jumps up out of the box, gets in our laundry room, goes around the laundry and gets into the wall. I had to bust my wall open. And that should have told me everything that I needed to know about her because it's been it's been that exact energy this entire time. But she she was needless to say she was super feral, super feral. And now we're we're two years in. She's okay with my touch. Hi. But yeah, so basically that's the story of how I manifested Myrtle. I also didn't know her name, what her name was gonna be. I never like thought about other animal names. I knew that like Annika named Luna. And once her name was Luna, we, we wanted her name to be Fang because that is Hagrid's dog's name in Harry Potter. And then when she went with, once Annika went with Luna after Luna loved good in Harry Potter, then I was like, let's just stick. There's so many character names. Like there's in town, like there's so many names you can use from Harry Potter. So I'm probably just going to do Harry Potter names for the rest of my life. And we, I put on my story, like, what does she look like? Well, I want to stick with the Harry Potter names. And the first person, the first time I saw Myrtle suggested, I was like, she is she's moaning myrtle she is moaning myrtle and i love her also i just met my new neighbor <laughs> my megan the stallion shirt i came around the corner and i was like i'm in my platform of like, megan the stallion shirt i hadn't started crying yet so i, I looked a little bit better than this and it was my wonderful new neighbor and i was like i walked around the corner and it's also i you know i mentioned i had a 17 year old and it's the, oh you don't look and i was like she's probably like what 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 is this girl's deal <laughs> But anyway, I was coming back from getting packages and it's freaking water. So we have this brand, I asked to send this stuff. We got to look over the website and send some options. So I don't know like what they sent. I let AJ pick something and then me too. Oh, this is the dress. Pretty, oh pretty. It's like flowy. Oh my God. Oh, and it can like cinch at the waist. Very fun, very fun. It's by this beautiful brand, Spell. So pretty, and this is the Belladonna gown in dusty olive. Look at those colors. I think this is what I, one of the things I picked out. I think it looks like it might fit both of us. Ugh. Oh my god, I love this. Okay, this is the Midsummer's Dream Knit Cardigan. Oh, you know, I've been so in brown for like literally the past year and I love pink too. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. And it's so fall, but it's like so, or it feels literally like a like, knit blanket. I can already tell I love this. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's so cozy. I need a PSL. Oh my god, I need Starbucks. That's freaking cute. Well, I'm picturing me on like a chilly like beach somewhere, like reading a book and this. This is cute. Thank you so much, Spell. This is, this is incredible. I will link these two pieces below. I also know that you can find them on Revolve. I've seen them on Revolve before. I am here so often, at least once a week.
Look who's home. I am bent out of shape. My knees hurt, my feet hurt. I don't know she how she used to do it. I don't know how she used to do it. She worked, uh, or she walked 16,000 steps. And she six said, this months. is what I did at Disney. I said, and this, it ain't as big as Disney. Imagine how many laps I was doing. Ouchie. Yeah. I, I don't know how you did. My respect for your work days. <laughs> through the roof. Five days a week, girlfriend. So, so, most of the time more, because then the part-time jobs. Were, yeah. We're trying to decide what we want to eat. Because I, neither one of us have energy. Uh-uh, I'm, 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 you know, the last two vlogs has been those seven days before my period, now it's Now here. it's the, the now nine it's days here. of the period. So now I'm not emotional anymore. I'm just exhausted and, mm, you know? Mm. We have oh fully loaded pork taquitos that look Fantastic. We have meatballs. That with, doesn't look what I'm wanting tonight. This looks healthy. Like this yeah. looks like a lunch. We can do this for I, lunch. I don't want healthy right now. You've been wanting this since you saw it. That's so much work though. To crust it, a lot it of in work. Like. Yeah. So this is gonna be our best bet. But we don't have to do HelloFresh. You could we can get HelloFresh tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> just okay. saying. We just got it in today, so we usually get so excited about them and can't wait, but I just really, I mean, I have, I'm at zero. See, so I told you what I say. Okay, well, this doesn't need to say open. So, if we're not doing hell first, then this can probably be a close. I'm so exhausted, I can eat nothing and go to bed. And well, I'm honestly, with you, having, when you, with you having work again tomorrow, you, she picked up a shift tomorrow. I, mean, I didn't pick up a shift, I got scheduled. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. Right, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's great. and I need to get weekend experience under yeah. my belt because... I feel like that like, is double it. That's like multiple shifts. To give context on prom season, because I'll be working there in prom season mm -hmm. before we move. Guess how many appointments we had today? You had 24 appointments today. Well, we had 15 appointments. Okay. And I don't know. I didn't know any sort Probably of 30 walk-ins. Okay. So that's, what, yeah, that's more of what I was thinking. Okay. Like, Guess how many appointments we usually have for prom season? 81. No, I'm just kidding. Um... 55. Add a one in front of that. 155? 155? I'm not going to be able to survive. I'm going to be, I'm going to be not okay when I get home. Do I need to come to work with you? I can I help. Mean, yeah, you can be my runner. She's you like, I brought my mom as my sister. She's just going to be running my dresses and don't mind her. <laughs> Imagine. Everybody else would be like, wait, nothing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Just, That's crazy. What, what if you're like a wedding um, dress? Like, what if you did this with wedding dresses one day at like Kleinfeld's? I would. Yeah, say yes to the dress. I said that to my girl. I said, is this, are you saying yes to the dress? Is this that. your girl? Is, is this, this your dress? dress? Is this your dress? Have you found your dress? What's been your favorite dress that you sold? Like, do you like when they're, like, do you like when they're the same back they're as you? They're honestly all so different. Come but on. I sold one today. I'll show y'all. It might be my favorite that I've. I'll show you the one I, sh I did today that I, I think might be my favorite that I've... No one's bought it yet because everyone's scared of it, but I was excited for it, too. Everyone's scared of it. <gasps> Gorgeous. Gorgeous. So, yeah. I sold that one today. I was really excited. About Wait, it. so you can't have short dresses for homecoming? You can have long dresses for homecoming. No, it's usually short dresses, but some shorts do long. Oh, okay, yeah. Like how court does long. Like the yeah. girl that I got to today, that she want, got yeah. one long one for court, one short one for the dance. Yeah, court. Our court did long dresses. Some of them you can only do white. You can only do oh. long white. Everyone looks like they're in a bride, and all the moms freak out. Yeah, that's interesting. You're just like voted in your class or not well, we like got a, I worked yesterday but it was like the ending shift and so I was putting away all the inventory of the day the when I tell you I've never wanted more dresses in my life never really? wanted, they were stunning they were all new arrivals yeah stunning and I was talking about New York Fashion Week show she's like yeah there's the Ashley Lauren show and I was like what what do you know we about watched it? the Giovanni show as we went Fun. as we put up our inventory last night Fun times. wow yeah. I feel like if, if we're gonna do a help <laughs> What if we did this? The willpower is taking not to get in the car and go to McDonald's right now. I I I'm gonna be honest, I asked her to stop on my home and she I'm said no. I'm trying not to do fast food we're, in this We month. are we're actively not we, since before we went to LA, like we've been we've That's not, we not right. true. I would get Chick-fil-A anytime I passed it. When? I'm on my way to work. I've never seen you. You didn't see on me at work. I'm gonna make a cheese case again if we're not. I can't have cheese. It's not fair that I have to figure it out by myself. I have 
dairy free cheese. It's not. Okay, it's Hello Fresh out of the out of the equation for today. No, it's not. And if it's not, that's the one I want. This is the only option because that one's gonna take too much work, and that other one's too healthy. Okay. So we already had it there to this one. The thing is, I don't want to do anything, even if it's minimal. Okay, it's only four steps. I've never seen one that are only four steps. I know, and that's why I said, I looked and I was like, oh shoot, it does look pretty easy. And I'm not even probably I've doing I've never anything. seen one four steps. And it, what, says 15 minutes, ready, 30. See, we could have already been back to the off now. <laughs> this, this is my thing that, that, that me, <laughs> the chicken nuggets aren't even real. Like, it's not no, even. I'm not even real, so it, they're just good. It's little snacks. I wish I could see my feet right now. I'm so tense. Push my leg. Push my leg. No, that is your penguin. Oh. I think that there's one time a month that I'm able to do whatever I want, and this is one of. The, and it's Saturday. Flip a coin. Let's flip a coin. Okay, we're coin. Who has a coin? We can't find a coin right here. I said put my wallet. So we there is a thing, but it's the whole jar that we yeah, like to start. Okay, ready? Hold two on. Two out of three or one? Yes, two out of three. If you win, we go to McDonald's. If I win... Yeah, what do we do if you win, huh? I'm making some dumb ones. And <laughs> you're <laughs> <my own kid. laughs> If you really wanted to, you could go get McDonald's for yourself. Do you know what it takes for me to get out of this house? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I know you want. Okay. Go see Yeah. Okay, ready? No. Okay, come on. On oh, shit. Okay. Yes. Right. Come on. Rock. No. <laughs> it's about to be rock, paper, scissors. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <gasps> Why would you do that? <laughs> How did you do that to me? Question mark. Do you know who that's from? Louis. Louis to us. Countess. Okay. Rock, paper, no. Oh my god. It's rock, paper, scissors. No, it's rock, paper, scissors. Shoot. Okay, sure. Rock, paper, scissors. Shoot. <laughs> you have <laughs> never <laughs> won first two. Ever. 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 <laughs> I will drive you to McDonald's. No, I don't have to. And maybe get soon. something. I didn't have full power today. You know what? It's so good. It's so good. And it's only good every now and then, but when it's good, it is good. I mean, this almost has me thinking it's real chicken. What's your dip of choice? I didn't get one. I didn't mean to not get one. Do you want to go back? I'm really not. I'll pop in there. Mm, is this mm. across the street? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Do you know crispy? Uh, mm. Mm. Nice. Yeah. Cheers. Good morning. We are starting today off the only way you should on a Sunday morning in Tennessee, and that is with chocolate gravy. Now listen, my stomach feels pretty weird after that McDonald's last night, but that's not going to stop me from seeing chocolate the next three days. So, if you don't know what chocolate gravy is, it is truly like a southern staple. Southern staple. Like if you have a southern grandma, you have had chocolate gravy and biscuits. It's so hard to explain. It's the same exact consistency as a gravy that would be like a, a on a normal biscuit. Like a thicker or just a, you know, a gravy. Okay? But it's chocolate. And it goes on biscuits. So it's chocolate. And it's carbs. Yeah. Okay. So, this is what you need. Cocoa, flour, sugar, salt, milk, butter, vanilla extract, and biscuits. I mean, come on! Come on! It's also crazy how when you get older, your period gets worse. Like, we've not been dealing with this our whole lives. You know, there'll be some months where I don't complain, but I'll rarely not complain. But I just feel like if you have a full, a full uterine lining shedding out of your body, like, you get to be, you get to eat chocolate. You know, you get to be kind of irritable. You get to cry more than you normally would, you know? And when you've cycle synced with people you live with, you can really make the best of it.
perfection. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I've never made this before because even my Nana, my Southern grandma herself said that like nobody's is better than my mom's. My mom's can't be duplicated, so I've just, I'd get hers when I want it, but we're wanting it today. That tastes just the same. That tastes just the same. I've been scared to make it this whole time. Oh my God. Ain't nothing better. I said this is a Southern mama's on a freaking Sunday. Wow. Wow. Guess who's here? I'm back. Maddie. She said she got me a gift. Oh. Oh. It's oh. With me losing weight, almost all my fit. rings. Yeah, none of my rings fit in It only came in a size so, seven. Look so. at this. Oh my so god. Cute. So cute. Look I love it. This. So cute. Perfect. Maddie, thank you. It's from Revolve, you said? Yeah. Here's bought, the brand. Just saw it and I'm gonna get it. Oh my god, that's so cute. I do have to show you what I was thinking about getting Annika, but I'm trying to decide if I should just get it and wait and hold on to it. Yeah. She's got a bunch of like milestones coming up. Maddie just left and AJ is on her way home from work. And she just called me and asked me to immediately start on this onion crunch chicken. The recipe actually has the potatoes as mashed potatoes, but I'm kind of wanting some like crispy air fryer potatoes. So I'm dicing these bad boys up. Woo! Annika just almost walked out the door with her flying to the ground, to the ground. And she said she didn't get work there today. Mom! <laughs> but nobody saw you. No one saw me. Okay, day three of your shift. You're Anna Hyde, shift three of three. No, this is four of four. Oh, well, I mean, you do a little bit different. This is my OCD Zara, same Target jeans I wore two days ago. Converse. Show me your little bow. And my bow from Cider. Look how cute. Okay, I gotta go. Okay, bye. Love ya. Love ya. Do you want the door behind me? Yes. Today is a sad day on the j and channel. I don't know if you guys have all been around since our viral video, but most of you have. And that video, I knew that I obviously wanted to tell that story, but I was very strategic about it because I really did want to take YouTube serious. And I knew if we like told that story first and like people came to our channel with just that video, like there wouldn't really be an incentive to subscribe. So I really wanted us to kind of start getting comfortable with posting vlogs and things, but obviously with me working full time, it was, it took forever to kind of learn how to do all of this, then actually do it. And I thought my birth story would do good, but I didn't, obviously have a clue i wasn't expecting it at all for it to do as well as it did but because i wanted it to do well i knew that i wanted to wait until i bought my first vlogging camera and i wanted to save up until i bought my very first like good vlogging camera and the one that i decided on was the canon m50 and after like so 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 many hours of research and like watching other vloggers and then figuring out what camera they have like seeing what quality that i liked and so i ended on the um, canon m50 and i was trying to to save up for it because it was like $650 or six almost $700 for the whole like the kit and so obviously that's a crazy amount to save up and like we didn't have extra to save and I was trying and I'd, I'd save up to 300 and then I'd have to use that on emergency something else and then I'd save up to 200 again and then you have to use that on emergency something else and finally it was quarantine had hit 
and I was like already working from home and I was like you know what on Friday when I get paid I'm just going straight to Target and I'm picking it up I'm not even getting it shipped like I, I, it actually might have been when I woke up that morning and like had gotten paid I was like I'm not doing this anymore like I'm just going and getting the camera like I know this is gonna be an investment for myself and so like I can figure it out so I bought that camera came home watch so many tutorials about like how to adjust it how, how to set it up how to use it whatever filmed that video with this camera and it changed our life like it this camera really had so much to do with that moment for us and we have just loved this camera so much after probably about a year of using this is the lens that came with the kit this is just the kit lens it's a 15 45 lens and it's great it's great it, it just kind of crops maybe like it'd probably be right here like you wouldn't see this much but after about a year and a half of having this camera with this lens I was able to then upgrade to the lens that I have now this is the wide I mean like y'all y'all can see a lot I, I feel like the other one probably is like this. Yeah, I feel like this is his 22 and then where this is what was this one? Kind of so it just is really really nice especially for vlogging like I just I feel like y'all need to see the bigger picture You know so the lens is more expensive than the camera Let me just say that but like that is that was a goal that was like the next goal that I gave myself I think I got it like right before vlogmas one year like I love this lens. I love 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 this lens so finally well over three years later because we got it in April 2020. It is now September 2023. The camera's just now starting to have issues. And I have like dropped it a bunch. I have like, I've vlogged hundreds of vlogs on it now. Like it's been through it and it still has been working great. But I think, I don't know if it's like battery issues because I've got several batteries and like not all of them are Canon batteries. But I, I think she just needs like a break. And you know, we just had gotten the Sony one as like a backup for both of us when Annika's other camera. We've, we've just been dealing with some camera stuff. And finally I was like, okay, it's time. It's time. I don't think we're not retired we're not retired and it'll be great for like maybe if we do have a podcast eventually like we'll have two cameras that we can use for our video footage or we'll just you know but I got a new camera I did just get the body because like I said the lens is now like one of the most important parts of the camera and instead of like having to then invest in a wide lens I thought about just going ahead and getting a wide lens for the Sony and I was just like at the end of the day at the end of the day this is just so baby. okay wait it looks like there's a whole should just be the body oh yeah just the body looky there looky there hi nice to meet you wow oh she feels new oh also this has come off of this guy and i had to super glue it back on and that holds my sliding like i i have to have that but the back of my other one is off like all this is ripping up okay Okay. Oh yes, we have a freaking strap. Thank goodness we have a new battery. We are we are in luck, you guys. Okay, I think I want to get her switched over. I also got a case. This one will also last almost four years as well. I mean, this one is still go gonna be going. Okay. Should I show y'all? Um, I guess I'll do it when I switch over. I'll show you the difference between this lens and this lens. Truly, if you're at the point where you have been vlogging on your phone for a while or you just got the money to go ahead and invest in a vlogging camera immediately, I definitely think like use your phone for a second and see if you like even vlogging and editing and the whole process. But once you're ready to upgrade to a camera camera, this is just, this will never not be my favorite. Canon M50. This is the Mark II. There is a Mark III as well, um, but I've read that a lot of people like the Mark II better, and that's what I have, so I just stuck with it. But this is iconic. It's mirrorless, so it's like so lightweight. It's beautiful. Okay, let's change her out. Okay. Voila. It shouldn't hopefully look too different. I did give everything a nice clean. Sorry about the construction. There's the, I, there's nothing I can do. But I did want to show you the kit lens. So this is the 1122. Okay. And this is the other one. This is as wide as it goes. It can zoom all the way like there. But honestly, I love this lens. and I'll travel with this lens because I feel like this lens, I don't know, I feel like this lens can be a little bit more crisp than this one sometimes. This one takes incredible pictures, incredible pictures. This one with the photos, the flash, you can see the reflection of the lens. So the lens comes out so long that, like if I took a picture right now with flash and this lens on, like right here would be like a dark shadow. So this one is great for pictures, truly it has, 
some of the best pictures. It's like how everybody loves the G7X photos. This one's a great one too. But this lens totally, I mean, look at this. This is the one it comes with. Like, so it's it's a great, great, great starter lens. And then make yourself another goal and have this as a reward or something. But that is, I mean, I, I can't stand up getting these out of this camera. Woo, and then here's, oh my God. Let me switch back to my my wide lens and, I, and we'll, we'll talk about this girl. Here she is. Look at my girl. So you can tell, like, you can see every single place. My, like, three years. That, I mean, this has been in my hand almost every single day for three years. This is where these fingers were. <laughs> and then on the back, we are, we're, we're rough back here. Let's see if we can. All of this is coming up. It's so annoying. And then this was the first part to start peeling off. Because this is where I really, like, that spot right there i can hold the camera so well with so this gets a lot of weight wow every almost every single vlog you guys have probably watched have been on this camera i think i'm gonna like put her kid lens back on her and then we'll just sit her on, on a shelf maybe even in a glass box <laughs> And then when we need to use her, we'll bring her out and celebrate her. But like, oh, she's lived such a good life. Thank you for changing my life. Everyone go to Cannes Instagram and DM them and tell them how much we appreciate this camera. Okay, bye for now. So next up, we have another package. Also, I have been linking all of the gear that I use for the video in the description. So most of my like camera and lens and everything links are in the description of the videos, but they're also always in my Amazon shop. Okay. Next up, this is really exciting. So if you don't know, the last time we went to New York, we road tripped in May, I believe. One of Erica's favorite stores ever is New York or Nowhere. And they just have the coolest, it's the coolest brand. And they just opened up a storefront like two times ago when we were there. And we like were able to go like the next week after they opened. And we just, we just love them. They started out as only like prints, I believe. And it's like now everything. We have socks, I have a necklace. <laughs> we have plenty of like crew necks and things, but we never got a poster. And the last time we were in store, we had Luna with us. So Annika went in first and I sat back with Luna and then we were gonna switch. So she comes out of the store and she's got a huge poster coming out of the bag and there, I was like, Annika, I know that we didn't agree on a, you getting a poster going in there. And she, her mouth is on the floor, comes out. She got it for free, got it for free. She was talking to the guy and he like that, she's just, you know how she, she can talk to anybody and she's just like so, incredible and awesome and perfect and wonderful and so i guess he knew that and he was like you know what we've got one in the back that i've been trying to get rid of it's got a scratch on it like do, do you want it and he, she was like yeah he brings it out it's the exact one she just said that like if she had to buy one i think he asked her like if she had to choose one which one and it was the one she freaking has which is the receipt so that's the only like poster of new york and i wear that she has and she wants to do um either like she wants to do somewhere and once we're in new york like a collage wall with just like only things that she picks up from vendors and flea markets and things like that and so we have a friend that sadly leaving New York. Miss Anna Hyde, side eye. No, I'm just kidding. She's leaving New York and she is bringing on that coastal cowgirl life. And so she was getting rid of a lot of her New York apartment stuff. She listed these and I text her immediately and said, girl, if you don't shift those to Tennessee immediately. So I sent her a quick little Venmo and look what we have. We have what? Look how gorgeous. Oh my god, I'm obviously not gonna read this whole thing, but it's just like, you'll decline invitations to go to museums, Knicks games, and top of the rock. You'll consistently take for granted all the, like, it's just, it, uh, it's just, it will always be New York and Nowhere. That's just so cute. So cute. And I feel like if she's got like a bunch of New York prints, like she's gonna need not just skyline ones, you know? Okay. Then next up. This is one of the ones she's always wanted. I feel like she wanted the, there's a baseball field one, this one, and then the receipt one that she got kind of was her top three. Oh, and there's one with the cab on it that she really likes. But how cute. But also like now she has three, so she could do them like in a row over her bed. How freaking cute you guys. Font is just so nice. Oh my god, I love it. Also, they do um, mystery items. We've done it several times. I got a freaking $75 pair of sweatpants for $20, $20, okay? And they're, great quality they're black with pink this down the side but they on their website they have free computer backgrounds of all of their 
images and free phone screen backgrounds that you could just like check out and then download. Annika always makes like collages and then she always uses whatever season. They come out with different ones for each season. So like new spring ones, new ones during Christmas, whatever. And also on the website, there are like mystery items and they have mystery item coffee mug, mystery item hat, mystery item t-shirt. And you can check out with whichever one and your size and then you'll get a mystery item. So we've done that a couple times before too, but this is just so freaking cute. And it also is like so fun that still now that she has three and she's never had to buy one. <laughs> Here is the one she has. I actually just did on my Instagram a couple days ago a story of all the New York stuff in her room because it's so, I mean, she is manifesting her way there. She really is. We got these two. These are so fun. We got these um, from Bryant Park. How fun. Her wall was already painted pink and she wanted to bring something back. And so when we saw this like pink one, she had to have. This one we had just been to Times Square and she just loved it so much. So she was like, I'm going to, I'm going to get two. And then we got these frames. They're like the glass ones that just hang or the, what are these called? Like invisible frame something. I don't know. It came in the two pack from Target and we love, look how cute. Okay. Next. She also got these from Bryant Park. Look at this one. That is literally Weasley in New York City. Look at that. How cute. These are so fun. And then she said she wants to like add more. So love them. This whole little corner is so funny. We've got the Mets homesick candle. We've got the I Heart NY M&Ms that we got in 2021. And then more New Yorker nowhere things. These are actually postcards, but they're like five by seven size. And so, oh my gosh, she's got them tight. So she, oh, this is the baseball one that I was talking about that she also loved but they're five by seven size and so we were just gonna get frames for her when she does her collage wall we were just gonna get frames for these for this size cute the, we love the subway tiles so like those are on subway tiles and then cute is that <laughs> and of course we have this pillow this pillow is so beautiful we actually saw them at i think it was union squares holiday market that we saw them in person but she actually got this online it's from a brand called calhoun and company so pretty and then the new york print over there on her wall of prints i just put them right here for now as she oh also another new york i don't know if this one yeah i think this one was new york this is from society six we just loved the pink like brownstone so pretty. I thought it was Georgetown for a second, but the Georgetown one we have is in the hallway. So I said I'm here. So when she comes home, she'll be able to decide if she wants to do anything with them now or like what we might like do something in the bathroom or I don't know. But I want to have them here when she gets back. Hey, look who it is. Um, well, look right there. <laughs> oh my God. Look how cute. Do you like them? I mean, it's gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. Where are we going to put it? I don't That's know. Right <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I have that in me, but, but I was thinking actually. You do have space there and there on top of both of the. I don't, I don't love that. I don't love that either, but you just really That's don't have a lot of. Well, we don't have to right at this moment, well, honey. Not right now, but like one, two, three, four, five, six, but, seven but white frames. But there's, there. there's, these have black. Each of these have black in them, though. You know. True. Where could we put them? We could put. I mean, nothing has to be done right at this moment. Well, no, we're just getting ideas. Mm -hmm. Okay. We could take the flamingo down and put these up. Should I put them over my TV? I mean, that's an interesting place to put them. Hmm. Do you want to look in your bathroom? No, I need them to be in here. Well, more importantly, where do we put them right now so my cat doesn't touch them? I think just set them back up there where I had them. Mm -hmm. Just for now. How long is for now going to turn into them? Also, this dress from Amazon, it was supposed to be Amazon. It was supposed to be for my Disney trip. It's really, really cute. So I've actually got my Abercrombie tank on Order it. Order smaller. But if it... Like, I, I just had a regular bra and it, like, cuts out right there. It's so cute. And then it came with these shorts that, like, have full pockets underneath. And they're detachable, so I really like it. She, well, as soon as she lifted it up out of the package, I was like, oh, that's going to be too big. And I was like, why? I think I posted a TikTok about it. Oh, yeah. I really like it. And it's like that, like, waterproofy. It's fun for hot girl walks and, uh, you know, love. Okay. Mom is on her walk with Tuna, her nightly walk, and I thought it might be a nice little thing just to get dinner started while she was on the walk so that we could finish it up when she gets back. And I cannot freaking tell you how excited I am to watch the VMAs. 
So, we're gonna pick a HelloFresh to make together. We have two left, we already made one for this week. It was a like crispy onion breaded chicken situation. So good. And the ones we have left is meatballs with, I'm not gonna try to pronounce this, with like that, sweet potatoes and rice with meatballs. But the fully loaded pork taquitos look really good. And this one is four steps. So I do think we're gonna go with the fully loaded pork taquitos. And thank you so much, HelloFresh, for sponsoring this video. And let's get right into cooking. Alrighty. Fully loaded taquitos. Look at these tortillas. We'll put cheese on two of them for mom and guacamole only on one. Look at this produce. One thing I love about HelloFresh is that the produce is always fresh and at its peak freshness because it goes from the farm to your door in less than seven days. So it's always at perfect freshness. We got some sauces in here and a lime. Oh my goodness, we got hot sauce. Mom's gonna love that. What is this? This looks good. Okay. Let's get started. A busy fall schedule doesn't always leave time for you to spare, especially with me starting my new job. With HelloFresh, you don't need to spend all evening in the kitchen to whip up a wholesome meal. With HelloFresh's quick and easy recipes and 15 minute meals, you can get a tasty dinner on the table in less time than it takes to get takeout or delivery, especially this one with four steps, perfect. As you guys know, me and mom have been doing HelloFresh for years and fall is definitely our favorite with a delicious lineup of meals from HelloFresh because new season equals new recipes. With HelloFresh, take your pick from 40 weekly recipes that suit your lifestyle from veggie to family friendly to fit and wholesome. Just so much. I can literally already feel my eyes watering up. Wow, onions are so strong. I don't know if you guys remember how long we have been like working with HelloFresh, but HelloFresh literally taught me how to cook. Like that's no joke at all. We were in our old apartment getting these. I think our Aunt Mary got it for us for Christmas or something. And it literally, it was in the prime of my like chef, Chop Chef Junior, Baking Junior, all the junior cooking shows. And I got in the kitchen and I whipped up a meal like my life depended on it. Like I got a hundred grand on the line. And I sure didn't, but guess what? I served up a meal. Well, huh? Listen, the cheese is the glue, so I'm allowing myself to have a little bit of cheese tonight. At least. Oh! Is she nom how many is she nominated for? I think four. Then three. Two. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say at least two. I was even if it was gonna be five, I was gonna say three. So, what if it would have been three? Then two. You think they're gonna like be like she doesn't? I mean, there's so many categories that her and Beyonce overlap, and they both just have wonderful. I mean, for lack of a better word, eras and times and songs and tours and albums and moments. Mm -hmm. They're both just like That's so great, wow. doing wonderful. You know? Yeah. So, I actually cannot wait to, to really truly sit down and, and, and judge. We got 10 minutes. <laughs> okay, I wanna try because like I, when I don't cook them, I don't know what's going on, you know? You get a preview when you're lining everything up in there. Mm. What's on the meat? What's on? Mm. It's mm. Southwest Spice Blend and Tex-Mex Paste. Paste. Well, you guys, you can go to HelloFresh.com and use code 50 Jenica to get 50% off plus free shipping. Mmm! The lime on it? Mm-hmm. Insane. Mm-hmm. Wow. I eat ten. Lime makes everything better. Try lime in your diet coat. Speak enough. I really could eat ten of these. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. We have like what seven minutes? None. None. Okay. We also need to start thinking about what our treat's gonna be. It needs to be like an hour into it so that we have something to look forward to and then something to keep us entertained the last yeah. hour because I'm gonna I'm get not. sleepy. I'm not. I knew this was a big night. I had it. That's why I'm having a late DC. Usually I don't have these past like 5 p.m. But I went to bed early last night and I woke up literally from 3 a.m. to like 5 36 a.m. I went to back to bed a little for like an hour, but I'm I'm already pretty. <laughs> but I need to stay up late tonight so I'll actually sleep a normal amount tonight. Okay, we're starting pre-show with the queen, Miss Sabrina Carpenter. She looks oh, freaking incredible. Her back is undone. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, she you can't even tell. She looks awesome. Well, she performed for opening day. She like top of the Yeah, she's prepared. Wonder what it's gonna be tonight. <laughs> Mm. 
Love her. Love her. It's time. Who is this? Who's opening? Who is it? Who are they saying? Hey, little, little Wayne? Little Wayne? Okay, the 17 year old in me is gonna come out tonight a little bit. I'm so excited! Oh my God. We're gonna go to the woods show with her. That is on my bucket list. Actually, I'm <gasps> I saw a prediction that she was about to rebrand from purple to red, and look, she's in red. She looks so good. Get it, girl. Oh my god, I love her. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, I love her. <laughs> Twenty twenty three MTV Video Music Awards Live from New York, New Jersey. Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. Nikki Minaj. For the first time ever, back together in like a decade. Make some noise. It's gonna be insane. For insane. What's going on? What's happening? I haven't seen those motherfuckers in years. Look at Taylor. Look at Taylor is freaking out. What is happening? What do you mean? Look at Taylor. It was our first VMA and it meant the world to us. I mean, no, I can I can tell you everything about their Baba video. Run it. All of you guys. Thank you so Taylor's much. reaction made it for me. That's crazy. It's gonna be One Direction up there one day. You ready to give out the first award? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. So here are the nominees for best pop. What? Are we going to start the night out with a Taylor win? It has to be Taylor, right? My heart is weak. <laughs> I wonder what my heart rate is right now because of what. Really? Okay, honestly, if, if Olivia wins. Okay. Oh, this is so hard. How do we pick? Which is this? What is this category? Best of pop. Oh, best of pop? Yeah. I'm going to be happy for whoever gets it. And the VMA goes to... We have been like this award shows for since she was three. The unstoppable Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. <laughs> We're starting the night off good, ladies and gents. We're starting the night off good, ladies and gents. I mean, she looks, y'all. If Annika and I could have dinner with any two people in the world, it would be Taylor and Selena. A friendship bracelet! Her dress is insane. Somebody just handed her a friendship bracelet. I didn't see which one it was. I'm not doing well pivoting from this <laughs> to this. Like, I have the I had your dolls. I like... Are you doing something? What's gonna happen now? <laughs> She's like, I want to interview you. They're gonna do something, and I need to know what it is. Really? It's, it's getting wrecked. Too much. Thank you so, so, so much. You're welcome, Taylor Allison Swift. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, best new artist. It's down to three. I Spice, Renee Rapp, and Peso. I asked. I had a Depp Brene rap in my top two. Here's our girls, Cardi and Megan. I love the blue. I love her hair. Oh, kill it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. 
Oh, yeah. She looks great. We just got a Demoon Lovato out of nowhere and a latex dress and she looks phenomenal. We have our very first, that is absolutely correct, Demi Lovato, her outfit dress, hair, makeup was all the absolute correct choice. She looks perfect, yeah. It feels like just such a good representation of her and she look, is exuding confidence okay. in that dress. Oh, she's strutting. I mean, that's it, that's what a dress like that can do to you. I mean, if I were to put that on, who would it? Really? Okay, K-pop was just won by, who was it Stray Kids? Yeah. Yes, yeah, Stray Kids. Obviously, I was going black pink. Wait, were they in front of them? They're all together. I was going for Blackpink, and my girls twice weren't even on there. But congratulations, Stray Kids. Look at freaking Nelly Furtado. Look at her. Look at her. Okay, this is song of the year, you guys. Song of the year. I'm nervous. You're nervous? I love this one. I love like 17 times in a row. I mean, she can do no wrong. Great song. This is song of the summer or song of the year? Oh man, that one took over the world though, for real. I feel like that one's been the most steady. Every, I mean, I mean, banger, banger, banger. Oh my God, what's gonna, what's gonna happen here? I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> yeah. I it's him. For anti-hero too. I mean, it is like a radio favorite. I feel like she just had Sabrina Carpenter. Look at her. Oh, let's hear her talk again. Let's hear her talk again. You know, Annika said earlier, I know exactly where Taylor Swift is right now. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> I could walk there. Uh, I love her hair. I need to do my hair like that. Everybody's bowing. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just very, I'm very millennial triggered by my choices of presenters tonight. Literally, Nelly for freaking Tano? I would cry. You guys are going to do something, right? Yeah, there's too many 90s icons coming out. I'm really, really lucky that I get to write songs with one of my best friends in the world. His name is Jack Antonoff. Yes, we know. We know. Why does she like know what to say like every time? I'm the only one who is feeling in that moment. Because she knows that's what she knows like words. Yeah, yeah she knows. I've got a stadium singing the words back to me. Ashanti's walking out. What in the heck is going on? What are they about to do? I don't know. Is okay, there about to fell in love with R&B because it's because of its many stories. About I fell in love with because of you, girl. Okay, SZA just won. Oh, I wanted to see her. Since I, it I won for Best R&B. I know, she would have killed it. Hopefully she's recording herself or something. Yeah. Shakira's getting the Video Vanguard Award, which is like the most- Oh my god! <laughs> There's no one else like her. There's no one else oh, like right. her! Fun fact. Why don't you tell them? I guess you can tell them. Something. Okay, the very, the number one song, number one, Billboard number one song, the day that she was born, was Shakira, Hips Don't Lie. This is one of my favorite songs of all time. Can't you see? I'm at your feet. Whatever. I had this album when I was literally in fifth grade, and my favorite song on the album was Underneath Your Clothes, which had no business being my favorite song. But just, you know, I felt the passion. This is why I love VMA Day and the day after VMA Day, because there's already videos backstage. Megan Thee Stallion and Justin Timberlake were arguing. What? About what? I don't know. Look at them in their, each other's face, though. Like, that's her face. And he's like, they talk like that. Boom, boom. Oh my god, look at her. This is what I was jamming out to in the labor and delivery room. <laughs> oh my god, I love her. To no one's surprise, Nicki Minaj is crushing it. Looks in incredible. Her eyeshadow looks so freaking good. 
everything. Ah, the best Latin. Go girlfriend. There's a lot of good ones in that category. A lot. So many. There was lots of winners for sure. Oh, I love her. She looks so good. Carol G was one of the craziest I've ever seen the Coachella crowd ever, ever, ever. It was, it was insane. insane. Honestly, Bad Bunny's probably the only other like person that it was that crazy for. And Blackpink. Look what we're getting a freaking commercial for you guys. And now we have Mary J freaking blush. Oh wait, Petey Deuce performing. And Shakira, so maybe that maybe that is the reasoning. There's some there's some two thousand era of the person who won the Vanguard Award. Yeah, maybe. So Puff Daddy is one of the global icon and his like I couldn't couldn't tell you who that is. I mean it's just I got no recollection. You know, I guess he hadn't done anything in a minute. I think I feel like he's not one of those rappers that's just still putting stuff out. Maybe you have to be, but to, for me to know. Yeah, but you should definitely know. Sean Combs. Luke Combs. <laughs> oh, my oh my god, that's his twins. His twins, his daughters just performed. I think that was them, surely. I think they were twins. I think that's my CD girl right there. Is it? Turn around, I need to see. I think it is, my girl. His son is back out there with him. That is so fun. It's a family night. It's just a casual family night. Family night <laughs> in New Jersey. For the combs, yep. Yeah. Okay, his twins came back out with him, and then his older daughter is is presenting the award to him. Look. That is so sweet, for real. I think we have to check out. I'm oh, so tired. I have to do this. I know, I'm so tired. I think it's going to be the best for both of us. I this know, year. and this fan has been on this whole time, and my eyes are, like, dry. I'm ready to go to bed. I feel like we were, I mean, that we were up for the, like more than half. Yeah, so. Yeah, there's only probably like 40 minutes left of it. We got it, but I can't do that. Also, it will be on, it'll be on Paramount tomorrow. So we can finish it up. Herbert, I mean, Taylor and I suppose haven't even got it for yet. Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. What do you want to do? I'm probably going to go to bed. I'm not gonna be alone out here. I'll stay out here if you want me to. I'm not gonna beg. Oh. <laughs> I'm not asking you to beg, you weirdo. I keep thinking that this is my leg. Like, I keep thinking that that is, and I keep looking down and I'm like, oh my god, what is going on with my leg? Another throwback? Good morning. We're on our walk. Well, and she is, she's ready to go. She, we, is. she says that we brought the long leash and she and knows. And also. Yeah, the there's animal. balls, there's traits. She knows that this is not, this is time to play. Come here. Come it's here. long leash time. It's long leash, look at her chin. This is so much better than the other one we had. I'm so glad we got it. Remember when she read me to shreds? She took all of us to shreds at some point. It's it? downhill, mom, so be oh, careful. We might need to go. Look at her. Oh no. Let me maybe get down the hill. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, that's my favorite hill. That is my favorite hill. I think we're doing we're not okay, listen. She went. A, she went a little crazy for a second. We had to. We had to put her back on the normal leash. Can you sit. Sit. <laughs> Good job. Go, Chins. Go. Only, only, only if we can go on anthropology after. How could you do that to me? How could you put me on the spot like that? Okay, then do we just go to that thrift store right there? Or we could go to that Goodwill right there too. That one's always working out. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're trying to decide. Good morning. We're trying to decide where to get breakfast. I will go to... Flight tracker. It's a helicopter. I know. We're going to see what it's doing. Oh my God, that yeah. one's a crazy one. Yeah, that one's not a fun one. I have this app. It's called... Yeah. It's um, not even, that's the first time I've never seen it on there. Really? So I have this app called Flight Tracker, and it's so fun because when we're sitting in our living room, we just have such a vast, like, view of 
like this guy. a million and we're we're 20 minutes from the airport so we see so many airplanes going into the airport and i just like got so obsessed with these planes <laughs> i don't even know how i found this out honestly Probably and TikTok. every single time that you can you see a plane in the air you can I open this app and you can click on like there's one right over there actually let's see where they're they're going from st louis to orlando so they're not even stopping they're in nashville and it's a southwest plane like sometimes if they're private planes so you can click on them and i'll see like what company at their own yeah. <laughs> but this is fun this is this is one of my hobbies i would say i can say that now if, if somebody asks me what are your hobbies looking at planes i'll go to your I'll place if we can go to anthropology and you can get me a candle that i have my eye on well i already needed to get pumpkin souffle anyway so a win is a win okay let's go I'm totally down. It's my favorite breakfast place ever in Franklin. Can't and get enough. I, I love it. I can't get enough. And we just can't go downtown without popping a couple of our favorite stores. Yeah. I will say the place we're going to breakfast doesn't have great coffee. Yeah, they just have like the, the like, you get what you get coffee. coffee. And so we can either go in the Onyx, Onyx and Alabaster's or we can go in um, I wonder if they'll have any Halloween. They don't. Did you already go? <laughs> So you don't watch science when did stories, you go to, When fun. did you go to Onyx Alabaster? It's fun. You don't then watch you can it. go before work? No, I went I can one go with time. you. I went one time. I went one time. I just feel like I should know where you're at at all times. It was when you asked me to go get you candles. You knew exactly where I was. You went downtown? Why did you tell me about your house? latte? I posted about it. I thought you'd see it. I didn't see you post about it. And then you don't like me. <laughs> I watch everything you do. You're always my number one that pops up. You got stuff to sleep, like sleep in your eye. I posted about how the baristas oh are Swifties. God. We talked about it. I awesome. don't remember any of this. I even posted a TikTok about it. <laughs> no, you didn't. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go. <laughs> Why well, does it hit your TikTok now? Bit. Well, that was just the TikTok of when the when people I'm wearing my Airs merch and people ask, and then the caption is, "How was I supposed to know that you went is, to the coffee shop?" The caption that, is, oh, "The sweet when people ask you." Well, the barista that at the coffee shop was definitely a Swifty. We talked for 25 minutes. Oh, plus see, I posted the actual coffee shop on my Instagram story. I just thought that it was when I don't know what I thought. I guess. You didn't even say, did this happen to you today? <laughs> I was just like, yeah, that's an awesome TikTok. I love it. And I liked it. Hmm. So this is where we just had breakfast and then there's a store connected. We always exit <laughs> through the store. Oh, that's really cute. This is like what I've been looking for. That's really, really cute. Look, it's very free people. Yeah. Very, very free people. So cute. There's lots of Nashville stuff in here too. Oh my God, look how fun. We are on the hunt for a new clear like concert bag. No, this is so fun. They have the best ones like this for the holidays too. Oh, look at the little tennis the football. Oh. She can't even escape it, even in Tennessee. She can't even escape it. It's literally glistening. <laughs> we saw this one first and I picked it up to show her and she said, oh my gosh. She loves these. She currently has one of these. I have two. Oh, yeah, here it is. It's, it's an issue. It's because they're so freaking cute. No, I'm obsessed with this. This would be so pretty for like bridal style. Mm. That is gorgeous. It is called Wilder. So I'm cute. Giving Luke's. Yeah, it literally. Yeah, we just left Luke's. Yeah. Wonder if we're gonna run into Kirk today. Or I wonder if we're gonna run into Kirk today. We've stumbled in a store. This is what caught our eye. <laughs> but this right here, look at these. So fun. I know that. Oh. This is a whole Capri Blue section. <gasps> Every, this is all Capri, this is all Volcano. This is my favorite candle. Oh my God. I've never seen some of these prints. Oh my God, oh my God. Body cream. Is this a perfume? It's a perfume. It's a perfume. Is that a perfume? You know what? Sometimes you spray down top eats, okay? Eats. For deviled eggs. Come on. Black shorty cookie. More fudge, don't judge. Come on, 
Fine, Jane. I am what I am. Come on. Come on. There's the wrong red body. <laughs> and then that is just kind of sitting right there. We left. We popped in Tin Cottage. We like popping in there. They've got like good gift stuff. But you guys, this I've had from Maddie for forever. This one from, this is an office people were looking at. Um, this one I've had from Maddie for forever. It's from Little Words Project and it's so pretty. It's got like marble little balls mm -hmm. and like lavender. And it says mama. And then I wear this one from Samantha Joe all the time. And I just needed like more, but I wanted them to be like, like stretchy, taking them stretchy. off and like, yeah. yeah. So I got the gold. How fun is this gold one? This is like a like iridescent and yeah. gold, would you say? And then this one I got to like tie in the colors in the mom one, but I think it looks so it's cute. So I got cute. A stack. This is my first stack ever. A stack. You got a stack. Fun times. <laughs> strawberry matcha. I got a dream sickle yeah. latte. It's vanilla and orange and it's just so subtly perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's great. And then this strawberry matcha is fantastic. It is so, it tastes like a little like strawberry she cake. She's nervous, but she mm -hmm. really likes it. Mm -hmm. I'll try to try a lot of matchas out so that I can perfect mine at home. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yes, yeah. That's how you know it's our kind of store. Y'all, oh, it's pajamas. I thought it was like a beach t-shirt. It's freaking pajamas. This is the perfect place for bachelor parties and birthday parties. Also, any just any kind of party. Annika's first matcha try. <laughs> I'm nervous. I like that, but I'm not convinced that's what matcha actually tastes like. Yeah, because it's strawberry. That's good. Yeah, I know. It tastes like you're. I hope I can figure it out. I know. You're all healthy. <laughs> I hope I can figure this out for real. This will be a game changer for us. Yeah, it's really good. We're getting in for losing our minds. It's losing this, our minds. It's so bright. I don't know. It, but it matches. We have this. Yeah. We have this. And we love. And look at how cute these are. Look okay? at how cute it's, these are. You think it's cute decor that can sit out? It is. Next to that other one we have. Wait. One fourth cup. One third They're measuring. all measuring cups. Are you freaking kidding me? One third, One third cup. cup. Like Annika means, I mean, I just have. I've been wanting it for so long. It looks like a little freaking subway. We call it the subway tall collection. Yeah. These are just so cute. I saw these the other day. The freaking hearts yeah, on them. Yeah, too. The freaking hearts on them. Well, you know what? I said there were three, and I said we can't leave one by itself. So. And now, now there's two. Gone. There's two. Coffee's, Diet Cokes, Crispy Diet Cokes. Really? Yeah. I love this. It's like a flower vase. How cute. These literally look exactly like our CB2 sauce bowls. For real. They're, they're bigger. $2.99 for all four. I think I paid like $10 for them each. We did not find exactly what we were looking for in Goodwill. I had a very specific vision. It was niche. It was niche and there just wasn't anything. There was a good, some good glassware. There's always good kitchen stuff with that one. Yeah. Anyway, we are at our last and final errand of the morning. It is DSW, baby. Can you see it? Oh, we've done pretty good on time. Yeah, we have done pretty good on time. Yeah, and Annika's not letting me buy anything pretty much, so. That's not true. We I got mean, three I things wanted in the Ampro. Capri Blue. I wanted the Capri Blue candle and I wanted the perfume. And I there's didn't a couple say other anything things. about the perfume. You said it's not necessary. I said that about the candle. Okay. I just got us three candles. But you know, um, I won't say that I needed some money to tell me that, but whatever. So. Next up, I have had my eye on this like pair of tennis shoes that I like well, need, no, but I don't really behind want. The story. She's having a shoe crisis. I'm having a shoe crisis because I've realized that I'm for sure my foot has now settled into an eight, and which is fine. But I was like, I used to be seven and a half eight, and now I'm just like. Do you eight. know something wild? What? Nines. Those are nines. That's what your Aunt Marley was a size nine. Oh my, I can't. Yeah, so I'm a size eight. And so there's just a couple, ten and, and I don't have any tennis shoes right now that are like, you know the white tennis, or the pair of tennis shoes that you need to have for like cute outfits or like dresses and stuff? Like I need a cuter. I have my like sporty 
streetwear pairs. I need like a cute. Do you know what I'm saying? Yes, I do know what you're saying. These are mine. Okay. Well, I think I, I found some contenders here. and they're on sale here, but I want to try them on because they're still even on sale 70 bucks. And so I want to try them on before I commit. Because at the end of the day, I don't want a pair of white tennis shoes, but I know I need them. You need a pair. So. Okay, here they are. I like that they're like chunky, but not really any branding. I like that there's like this beige on the back. I like these guys. I do like these. These are like the Alexander Wang ones from Steve Madden, and they're really cute. And they have just a touch of black on the back. It feels like this comes up pretty high though. And like Steve Madden, I mean, there are some cute ones over here. No, these aren't even really super white. It's more of a cream for sure. We have not even said where we're going yet. Have we not? No. The mm -mm. drama? We are going to see the one, the only, our queen. Lana Del Rey tonight. We're so excited. I've never seen her. We, I've seen her once and she, I cried and it was beautiful and wonderful and everything, but it was like 2016, which also, listening to Lana in 2015, 2016, 2014 to 2016 hit different, but we are so excited. We're almost I out the door. hopes and dreams. Hopes and dreams. Yeah. And just because she's in the state of Tennessee, she's going to play on the beach all by herself. That would be wonderful. That would be great. I'm not going to say she's going to bring Taylor out, but... <laughs> She might play it by herself. Also, we did try to get tickets like as soon as they came out. We were both on five computers and we didn't get them. So we waited until yesterday. Or did we get them this morning? Yesterday. They finally dropped a little bit and then game time, which we always use, was doing like a flash deal and we were able to get like lower bowl, which were only like $300 each. We were able to get it for $150. So very excited, very ready, and I can't wait for oh, your life to change. Your hair look. Yeah, your hair looks awesome. Turn around, let's see. That. Gorgeous, gorgeous, Hello, very cute. And this is from Princess Polly. Princess Polly, we have the same so, one. So, whoop, whoop. Yes, we both have the same one. Very yes. cute, very cute. And then we've got That's some tennis. Shoes. This was a debacle. Let me tell you. Check my vlog out. But very to be cute. Able to tell. But it was a debacle. And then I am wearing this dress also from Princess Polly. Oh, we well, are just repping. It is Motel Rocks, and it's just mm -hmm. it's such a great dress. I was it, gonna do red boots and like a black dress and be super Lana, but I went into my closet and I said it has to be. It us. has to be it. It has. To, and, and I like to think when I'm going to concerts, like would the artist be proud of this outfit? And I think and she, she would. Yeah. I think she would. Tuna doesn't want us to leave. <laughs> He's okay. Y'all, we have got. We've got to get a new clear purse. I thought there was still rust on it from last time I cleaned it. Oh my god. This is Big Luke. Big Luke. This is so pretty over here. We've made about 14 wrong turns. Yeah, we have made a few wrong turns in the meantime. You guys, this is beautiful. It's like we're gonna like have to look for shows now here to, yeah, it's to like come. Kind of, it's yeah, like it's a quarry, so it's like in, built into the rocks. Yeah. Look how pretty. Cheers. Can I get a fucking heart? 